boards. It's, it's in the game. Chris Weidman enters the octagon tonight with one goal, and that is to become the new UFC middleweight champion. As he makes his way towards his cage, he believes this is his time. He believes he is destined to take this title. His preparation for this bout has gone absolutely according to plan. He's in fantastic shape with a great game plan, and he expects to walk out of this cage tonight as the new champion. Chris White enters the octagon with his mind set on just one thing tonight, winning the UFC championship. set to enter the octagon to defend his title. The champion is in focus. He is in his prime. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this camp has been absolutely spectacular. He believes he has a solid game plan, and his mentality coming into this fight is clear and focused. set to defend the undisputed UFC middleweight championship. Our tale of the tape for this middleweight championship fight. Evil Way is 26, Weidman is 37. He will have a six inch reach advantage. And now with our official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment you and see fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. <laughs> Six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds, fighting out of Baldwin, New York, presenting the challenger, Chris Weidman! And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a karate fighter, holding a professional record of 21 wins, no losses. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 175 pounds. Fighting out of Reno, Nevada, ladies and gentlemen, the reigning, defending UFC middleweight champion, Howard. UFC belt on the line, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch that, do it now, go back to your corner. What a build-up to this fight. Back and forth, bad blood. Both men ready to battle. Both men ready, ready? to leave it all in the octagon. Ready? And oh, yeah. here we go. The middleweight belt is on the line. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for white. Black trunks for the champion. We've been witness to many great championship fights over the years, but few have garnered as much enthusiasm as this matchup. It is certainly safe to say that this may be one of the biggest championship fights of all time. As this fight gets underway, it's important to put into perspective the magnitude of this competition. This is a huge fight, a huge championship fight with massive implications in the entire sport. Weidman connects. Joe, he's one of the most powerful punchers in the UFC's middleweight division. Now he's in the full guard. Ready? 
Lands a nice left. Joe, we know he hurt his left hand during training camp, and now we're seeing the result of that. He's hardly throwing it at all. He's moving to the right, trying to avoid that big right hand. Back and forth battle. Solid leg kick by Weidman. Oh, very nicely done. Oh, Rocked him with the left hand. hand. Boy, he is in big trouble, Mike. Vicious combination. Wow, Huge that's left a big hand. left hand. The All-American putting his striking skills on display. Solid jab. Huge oh, slam. slam. Inside control once again. Weidman's back in north south. Really good movement on the ground. Joe, he's showcasing some great movement on the ground. Howard gives up his back. He's got the full mount, Joe. 45 seconds in the round. Evil Way gets hit with that body kick. Another hard body kick from Wyden. Joe, you're absolutely right. The kicks to the body, significant thus far. Good uppercut by Howard. He's doing a great... Whoa! Oh, this is the body. And he goes down. He's in big trouble here. The horn sounds for the end of round number one. Here's a powerful knee that lands and causes the knockdown. Let's see this again. And let's look at it from a different angle. It's okay. Listen, look at me. Give me some water. Listen. You got robbed. Okay, it happens. It happened before, and it happened again. But listen, this round, I want you to do is protect it. Brittany gets us set for round number two. You ready? You ready? All right, here we go, round two. We continue this championship fight, and so far, so good for the top contender. He has worked so long and hard for an opportunity to be a UFC champion, and I think it's safe to say that so far, he's been the better fight. Man, that was a perfect counterpunch. A ton of quickness possessed by both of these men. Man, those body shots have been lethal. Look at the bruising on his right side. Looking for the head kick. Take a look at this. Kicks landing. And a nice one-two with the right and the left. Wiping with a solid beat. Oh, we got tagged with the hook. Oh, big kick. Vicious shot to the body. Oh, yeah, what a big suplex. Joe, that's a solid kick to the body by Weidman. Evil Way is continuing to attack that bad eye. He certainly is targeting it, and the more that eye swells, the less his opponent's going to be able to see the punches coming. Huge uppercut misses. Big shot landed. He's hurt. Oh, he's getting oh. tagged. Punch for the victory. Time now for our fight replay. And here we see the KO that retains his title. Brutal power lands in picture perfect fashion. His opponent goes limp and he retains his world title. Let's look at that from another angle. And here we see it again. Boom! Out cold. 
Here is Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 21 seconds of round number 2. You play the winner by knockout and still Remains the UFC middleweight champion.